The highlight of today's part of the Dorsal Gin Festival is the fire setting battle. The Dorsal Gin are the wooden male and female pair that you see around the village. They are fertility gods, which are celebrated with the fire festival for healthy children and to pray for a happy marriage. Every year, the fire is lit from the same family home, the Connor family, and the flame is walked through the village gathering support along the way. It is brought into the site dramatically and the bonfire is lit. This year there were two births in the village and these children are celebrated with the Toro. The Toro is a lantern to pray for their healthy growth and are made by relatives and friends according to the direction of the lantern master carpenter. They are about nine meters in height. The so-called unlucky 42 year olds are above and the 25 year olds below are positioned on the shrine to protect from the villagers. They call down to the villagers to bring on the fire. The villagers light their torches from the bonfire to start the battle. The younger ones at the bottom receive the full attack and are the main defence line to protect the shrine for as long as possible. There is no holding back. The battle continues for a couple of hours and is very entertaining to watch. The reeds are resupplied to the villagers down below. Once all the reeds are depleted, it's time to vacate the shrine. Eventually the shrine is lit, burning up any bad luck and cleansing for the new year. The end of the festival. All the hard work and effort that has been put in is over until around September when it all starts again in choosing the trees for the following year as part of the Autumn Lantern Festival. It is a wonderful cultural event to bear witness to steeped in history and an absolute feat for this village. The traditions and skills are passed on for another generation to continue binding the community of Nizawa Onsen together in the future.